So you might be in a position where for some reason your Wi-Fi on your iPhone just keeps disconnecting. Now, this can happen for a few different reasons, but the very first thing I would recommend doing for the most part is just going through and making sure that there's nothing wrong with your Wi-Fi router. Most of the time, if you're having some weird issues, it could be because of the Wi-Fi router that you have. So just double check that router and just make sure the router is not having the issue. Now, the next thing I would recommend doing is making your way over to your iPhone settings and just making sure your Wi-Fi is even on. So go inside of Wi-Fi and toggle your Wi-Fi settings on, or if you're on the top right, just go ahead and go into the control center, tap on and off that Wi-Fi, and that could end up addressing and fixing some issues as well. Turning off the Wi-Fi, then turning it back on can probably fix a lot more issues than you probably ever realize. So that's probably another thing you want to go and kind of check into it as well. Now, on top of that, if that still doesn't end up fixing the problem, the next thing I'd recommend doing is just going through and disconnecting that specific Wi-Fi connection. So find that Wi-Fi connection here, click on the eye next to it, and go ahead and basically reconnect to that network. So disconnect from it, and give it a few seconds, and then go ahead and reconnect, and you wanna see if that ends up fixing the problem too. I think for a lot of people out there, reconnecting to that Wi-Fi is probably gonna end up fixing the problem too, and that's another thing I recommend looking into as well. Now on top of that, if that's still not working, you may wanna go ahead and restart your iPhone. So hold down the buttons you need to basically restart your device, turn off your phone, give it a few seconds, turn it back on. That may end up fixing the problem too. If that still is not working, you may wanna go ahead and basically get into your settings application right here. And then you wanna go ahead and basically get into your general settings right here. You wanna click on software update, and you wanna go ahead and update your specific phone. That can very well end up fixing the problem too. So just by updating your phone, I've seen this time and time again be able to fix it. So just go and update your device, and that's probably another thing that can probably end up fixing it too. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.